history of Rwanda, women were not even allowed to touch the drum. It was exclusively for men. We wanted to propose a new chapter, a new era. People have to reconcile with themselves and with life because many people were really unhappy to be alive after the genocide. When you accept to forgive, to be connected to other people, then you move forward. When I met Jenny, I learned that she had an ice cream shop in New York. I immediately approached her. I thought she was going to ask me about importing tea from Rwanda. She said, no, no, no. I want to have an ice cream shop in my town. I'm very proud to be your partner, and I really, really believe in our success. <laughs> there were these women, they were drummers, they were performers, and now we want to translate those skills and that energy into a business setting. <laughs> something that's made of milk and very cold. <laughs> Trying is very important. Let's see how strong we are. No teeth, just your tongue. You, you it's good. When you believe that something is possible, it's done already. Mm. <laughs> 